Hi everyone, welcome to my new setup. If you'd like to know why I did this, you can go and watch my Dear March video. And if you'd like to know why this video is three weeks late, you can go and watch my mental health update video. I'm not gonna go over any of that right now. I've, if it's out there, you can go and watch that. Moving on to March favorites. At the end of April. Favorite March clothing. If there are two things I have a weakness for, it is food and shitty puns. So why not combine the two? And have a pizza slice that says in pizza we crust. Get it? It was from Primark, it was cheap, it made me giggle. By the way, yes, Helen also has one of these t-shirts. Yes, we were together when we bought it. Yes, it was intentional. Yes, we spend too much time together. My favorite March cosmetics are false nails. I bite my nails. That's quite a common anxiety thing. A lot of people do it. Uh, and I decided to try and combat this by painting my nails, but that started backfiring when I developed a new anxious tick, which was picking off the nail varnish. It got all over the floor, it got all over the dining table, it got all over the sofa, it got all over my piano. It was like everywhere. So I thought, okay, I won't put on nail varnish anymore. I seem to have kicked the biting thing, so let's just leave it for now. But what I'd started doing because I got into the habit of picking at my nail varnish was that I was just picking at my nails. It was starting to get really bad. They looked really ragged, really gross. Where I was picking them at the edges, they were starting to bleed a bit. And I just needed something, some way to prevent myself from doing that. And the only way you can really do that is to put false nails on. I'm not very good at sticking them on, but there you go. It stops me from doing that and they look pretty. My favorite March food is Dairy Milk Oat Crunch. About a year ago, I just picked one up because I needed something for breakfast and I wanted something like that I could eat on the go and was a bit sweet, but a bit savory. And this was like the perfect thing. And then I kind of forgot all about them. And then a few weeks ago, I was in the supermarket and I found a pack of three and I bought four packs of three, I bought 12 of these. Within a few days, they were all gone. And I wonder why I can't lose weight. Whoop. So it's like a slab of chocolate in like an oat biscuit cracker wafer thing. I can't really describe it other than delicious. Mm. Give me a minute. Ow, I got in a cavity, ow. Well, while I'm eating this, I might as well introduce you to my March favorite random thing. Ah, it's leaking. It's this mug which my mum got for me. It's got the Eiffel Tower on it, made out of gold flowers, and it even comes with its own little tea strainer. So you just put some loose tea leaves in the tea strainer, and then you pour the water in and the milk, and then it's got a little lid that you can put that into. It works a lot better when you have a table and it doesn't drip all over your beige carpet. I actually went to Paris a few years ago, but I didn't really have enough money to buy any souvenirs or anything. And then earlier this year, my mum went to Paris. She knew I loved Paris. She knows I love my tea. She knows me very well. Mm. And tea and chocolate together. Oh. Yeah. Mm. oh my God, there's crumbs all over my black leggings. I have one more much random favorite, and that is my new haircut. You might not be able to tell much is different now. It's a bit shorter at the front, but it's still pretty long at the back. I kind of frighten my stylist a bit by saying, I want an undercut. Like, oh god, how am I going to do this? Oh god, I'm doing this bit. There's my undercut. I think. I hope it's in frame. I must look very odd to the neighbors right now. It's so nice. It's so strokeable. I love it. Oh, my legs were given out then. Usually what happens in summer, because my hair is so curly and thick, it gets really sweaty, which makes it oily and greasy, which means I have to wash my hair at least once a day, if not twice a day. And because my hair's colored, it means the color fades faster. This is the first time I've been excited for summer since school ended. I hate heat. I hate it. I hate the sun. But I'm actually kind of excited about this year because I won't get annoyingly angrily hot. Ah, you might be wondering where my favorite March book is. Well, it's technically over here. Um, but as you can see, I barely even started it, even though I had three extra weeks because I was lazy in putting this up. So here's the deal. I'm not gonna do a monthly favorite book anymore. It's too much pressure to give myself a deadline to finish books. It's just not pleasurable to read when I have to do it by a certain time. Every book I read, I will talk about, I'll do like a small review of it and have a quick chat about it, but in a completely separate video. It might be a part of the monthly videos if it happens to coincide. Basically, it's gonna be a regular TBR wrap up series on this channel. As for the Peculiar Children book, seeing as the trailer has just been released, 
I'm gonna wait until the film comes out so I can do a book film comparison because I have quite a lot to say about the book anyway, but I feel like I'll have a lot more to say once the film comes out. Oh, and I know Christy said that she would come up with a forfeit if I didn't finish this book. So come up with a forfeit and I'll film it. That'll be funny. If you like this video, please like it, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And I will see you on the next video, whatever that may be. Bye. Ah, natural, natural whiteness shine through. I got a cup of tea. I got a cream soda. Shut up, bird.